I'm here with San Jose State wide receiver Noel Grigsby. Noel, how are you doing today? I'm doing great. I'm happy to be out in San Francisco at the Bay Area Media Day. So, having a good, good morning. Awesome. Okay, so coming off of last season, I know everybody's asking you how you guys had such a successful season last year. You guys were 11-2, but focusing more on you, you broke two San Jose State records just in one season. The most catches as well as the most receiving yards. You're only a junior. What are you looking forward to the most for your senior season? Oh, first of all, I've been blessed uh, throughout my whole career, but uh, what I'm looking forward to is uh, seeing a lot of my other teammates, you know, be successful. So, you know, it's good to have success yourself, but it's always good to see your teammates be successful as well. So, you know, uh, you know I'm catching the passes, you know, David Fells are throwing the passes, but a lot of the old linemen, they don't see a lot of light. You know, those are those are guys who work hard, too. Uh, we have a lot of youngsters who uh, push me day in and day out you know, on the scout team. Those guys don't get a lot of praise as they should, but you know, those are the guys behind my success. And my running mates, you know, Chandler Jones, Barry Carr, Kyle Nunn, a lot of the uh, up-and-coming receivers, uh, those are the guys who I work with too, so they don't receive a lot of light. So my, you know, my joy this year will be seeing them, you know, being a little bit more successful and, uh, you know, seeing San Jose State continue to be on the road. You know, we're, we won 13 of our last 15 games, so a lot of people, you know, talking about the new conference, but, you know, we're just looking forward to starting camp and having a good time with each other. Awesome. So you touched on giving a shout out to your other teammates. From an outsider's perspective, watching you guys over the past few years, watching you guys grow, it's been very exciting. I've noticed that it's been not just teammates, but you guys have almost created a brotherhood. Can you talk to me a little bit about how you guys have managed to do that, even throughout the times that weren't so successful? Okay. Uh, one thing I know, even with Coach Tommy back in the day, one thing we did throughout camp, uh, we, we got in meeting groups and we talked about our lives. So we got to know each other on a personal level, outside of football. And that, you know, once you know somebody's life, you know what somebody's been through, you'll play hard for them. So that's where the brotherhood started. And, um, you know, we have fun together, we go out together, you know, we party together occasionally. So, you know, we, we know each other's tendencies. So we have a good time with each other, even on a plane. I mean, on a plane, on to roaches, we have a great time. And uh, whether it's singing songs or doing things like that, that's where the brotherhood, you know, comes together. So it's just not just football, not just practice, but it's outside of practice, you know, outside of the games where, you know, we're kicking it, we're having a good time, we're going out together. You know, you know, I'll, I'll have uh, my teammates this day, they'll have me this day if we want lunch. So, you know, we're having a good time together. So that's, that's where the brotherhood starts. season obviously last year you guys ended the military bowl the news about coach McIntyre was a little bit shocking I think to some of you guys now transi transitioning into the next season so for the 2013 season new coaching staff how have you guys managed to again come together as a team but also come together with you guys as new coaches uh, well the thing with uh, coach Mac you know I'm definitely happy for him came to San Jose State you know turned the program around you know great uh, great stepping stone for him and his family so you know he taught us a lot of things but that's that's the game that we play so uh, since I've been here, we had about, I think this is my third head coach. So it's not, it's not something, it's not something different for me. But at the same time, you know, coming with a new coaching staff, you know, our job is to just execute as players. You know, we're just, we're just out there to play. And that's what we signed our, uh, our scholarship for, to come and play and represent San Jose State well. So, you know, we're looking forward to being on Coach Carragher. And as you saw today, you know, powerful, powerful speech by Coach Carragher, just breaking down the history of the school, history of the Bay Area as a whole. And, you can see the passion that he has throughout uh, spring ball. So we're looking forward to, you know, to working with him. And you know, when a coach is passionate about our teammates, you know, we'll play our hearts out for him. And that's what we're going to do. Awesome. OK, well, I'm going to follow you guys this season, obviously. Get sports focused. We're going to be all over you guys. I'm very excited to see the success that you guys are bound to, bound to achieve in this next year. And the best of luck to you in your senior season as well and the rest of your teammates. OK, thank you.